there's this new species uh, out there and it's a cockroach and uh, uh, people just who discovered it uh, decided to name it after a uh, new Pokemon that was uh, released uh, just uh, a year or two ago. This is what it looks like. That's the new cockroach. And this is the Pokemon it's named after. Now the colors are typically different, but uh, the similar thing there is the antennas and the body shape. So a Filipino led team of scientists uh, discovered uh, the new species of the cockroach uh, at Pukin. Uh, the Tina Nature Reserve in Singapore, and uh, they named, named it after the Pokemon uh, Formosa. The bug is named uh, Nocticula Formosa, which Formosa, the Pokemon, and uh, Nocticula Formosa. Which was a, a new species of cockroach discovered by Christian C. Lucanas, an epidemiologist at the University of the Philippines, uh, Los Banos Museum of Natural History, and the lead author of the study, and also Singaporean uh, entomologist uh, Fu Mao Shang was also part of this too. By Christian and uh, and Fu, uh, they uh, they they designed the name after the Pokemon, which the, the Pokemon is based off uh, the white appearance of the, where the, the American cockroach uh, molted. So like uh, there's a new look to the Pokemon. So this is the bug. Nocticula formosa. It looks like uh, a bug that would typically be underground and come about at night. They said there was a similar uh, stuff between uh, Feromosa, the Pokemon, and uh, the little cockroach uh, that they found, uh, such as having a long antenna, wing that mimic a long hood, and slender legs. And since uh, both uh, Christian and uh, Fu are a fan of uh, Pokemon, uh, they said, why not uh, name that after Pokemon, inspired by a cockroach? Uh, so decided to do it. And they count compared it to a house cockroach is that saying uh Nocticula Feromosa had a more slender and uh, delicate body. Uh, this represents the ninth Known fully winged uh, species of the genus, as uh, they wrote. This uh, discovery was published in the Journal of Asia Pacific uh, Entomology on February the 27th uh, of this year, and it's also the first time a cockroach of the genus uh, Nocticola had been uh, written down in Singapore. But uh, the two uh, came across the then unknown male species of the cockroach in uh, Bukit Tima Nature Reserve uh, in 2016. And they uploaded the photos to the website of the Biodiversity of Singapore, which uh, caught the attention of uh, Christian. And uh, and then he contacted uh, Fu. And Christian was the one who dissected the cockroach and published the study. So the Pokemon is right here.
Raramosa. In that uh, Pokemon uh, Sun and Moon uh, and Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon uh, game, which I have the extra feature that this is the Ultra Beast, uh, which uh, Ultra Beast is uh, like Imon, but uh, but they have uh, special moves and uh, are unique to the game and. And since it is a bug, but they in Pokemon, uh, when they released it in 2021, uh, they decided to make it a bug fighting type. Uh, Pokemon players uh, know that the special ability is Beast Boost and uh, the console ga games are uh, only Sun, Moon, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, and uh, only other games that will actually allow it uh, for it to be on. Of course, the Pokemon did not evolve. Uh, Ultra Beast, uh, they, the legendaries do not evolve. Uh, the special ability uh, Beast Boost. Uh, Boost up the stats of the Pokemon uh, every time they knocked out a target. Uh, and yet, uh, the Pokemon looks definitely uh, different to the actual bug, the Nocticula Feromosa. Due to the colors, that's in the, the bug, it's more brownish. Uh, it's not slender, while, uh, of course, uh, th this is a video game character. <laughs> Animal we're talking about, so of course it's going to be looking different, but... But how the features are different... Uh, the Pokemon that uh, is based off, like, an... Uh, American cockroach that molted, so, uh, and bugs molt, like most animals do, and shed skin. Get a new layer, and they keep doing that until they die or get eaten. So if you also wanted to catch the Firmosa, that was a one time short uh, frame time of uh, where you could have caught Feromosa and Pokemon Go if the mobile game. It's not really powerful compared to uh, other Pokemon such as uh, as bug fighting types. Uh, Heracross, uh, which is a bug fighting type uh, available in uh, Gen 2. Uh, but uh, they were all also, also good and And also the fact feature in uh, that you could mega evolve uh, the Pokemon. Which also gives the uh, extra boost. Uh, ex and soon uh, if you get it in uh, Pokemon Go, it will uh, be much more stronger, more HP, more damage. when you're attacking uh, opponents. And there's also Buzzwall, which is also uh,
also a same Pokemon type, but it also Ultra Beast, but it looks like uh, a, a bug that will uh, just rather uh, sting you. Do it down. Uh, do its front. And compared to that, uh, it might not be uh, worth uh, having. So, that's an introduction for a new bug to come in to the Nature Kingdom.